Catch up Christian Radio, KJLY. It's 15 past the hour. Daddy Goki, it's the comeback, the name of that song. Hebrews chapter 10, verse 36. You need to persevere. So when you have accomplished the will of God, you are the recipient of what he has promised. And recently, I was reading about the devastation of Hurricane Katrina. You know, some lost everything. They have to rebuild their lives from scratch. Some lost loved ones and precious memories. Well, one could feel a little overwhelmed or a sense of hopelessness in that situation. But we can always find peace in God's Word. 2 Corinthians chapter 12, verse 9. In our weakness, He will give you strength. When you're all caught up in the dark of night. Since I've known the Lord for 30 years, you know, and... Um, I just say that, that the Lord is very faithful. You know, I just knew that um, by my mom's passing that, um, you know, the, the, the Word says that the Lord is close to the brokenhearted. I am not my own. I belong to you. Catch up Christian Radio, KJLY, and it's true that we all live very busy schedules. For example, in your family, maybe one parent works the day shift, the other works the night one. You have children, two sporting events, getting the shopping done. Well, prioritizing family time can be a real problem. To the rescue, kidsforthekingdom.com, kidsforthekingdom.com, and they have a driving game with the kids in the car called the alphabet game. Now, each letter they pick must stand for something they are thankful for. For example, the letter H, thankful for good health. They also suggest putting a thankful journal together as a family. And I think this is a great idea. A thank you letter to God, praising God for all his blessings. Steve Camp now, thank you on KJLY. Thank you.